Red Diamond is too loyal back again with another video. We are reacting to another Diamond bonus video. Mom can't afford to pay child's operation. This video was once again requested, guys. I feel like I'm gonna cry in this video, maybe. But we're gonna see. Let's get into it, guys. <laughs> My daughter was playing outside and then she just collapsed. She's been unconscious for at least 30 minutes. She's had a heart condition ever since she was born, but I have never seen her like this. <laughs> Please wake up, baby, please. Open your eyes. Jen did OR3 prep and gave Dr. Adler in their stat. Open your eyes. Please tell me my baby's gonna be We're okay. We're gonna take everything we can for her, okay? What are they doing here? I was told we were gonna have a private room. All the private rooms are full. Unbelievable. She must be a bougie, rich type of parent or something. Look at how she's all. Oh, I told. I was told that we were gonna have our own rooms. You would think that after all the money that I spend in this hospital, that my daughter wouldn't have to share a room with a couple of illegals. Wow. Wow. We are U.S. citizens. <laughs> uh huh. What? They assume all all people that are foreign are legals like some hispanic or foreign people are born in america you know what i'm saying their parents may be from wherever but then they may have been born here you don't know so you can't just judge somebody based off of their nationality whatever who are you to judge me you don't even know me but i have eyes and everything about you from the way you dress can't tell. to the way you smell Screams poor person. Yep, she how you treat a person shouldn't be determined by how much money they have. That's what every poor person says. <laughs> I want a new room and I want it right now before my daughter catches something from one of them. I'm sorry, there are no open rooms. That's unacceptable. Do you know who I am? Call Dr. McGuire and he'll explain. We can't do anything right now, but as soon as a private room becomes available, I'll make sure that your daughter is moved, okay? Oh. Oh. He's one of them annoying Karens, like just find everything little to argue about. Cardona? The good news is your daughter is stable and she's resting comfortably. Unfortunately, she is gonna need heart surgery or her condition will worsen. Fortunately, Dr. Adler is one of the best heart surgeons in the country and he practices right here in our hospital. That kind of surgery sounds expensive. Yes, I'm afraid that the cost is significant. How significant? Somewhere around 150,000. Yet the cost will be offset by your health insurance. Uh, what is it? What's wrong? They don't have health insurance. My job got our health plan last week and I was gonna buy an individual plan, but the cost is just too much for me right now. She had been doing so good that, that I- That rich person knows she feel bad. Like she knows she wanna help. She better stop being evil. I thought I could slide by for a month or two. What kind of low life can't even afford insurance? Oh yeah, I thought she was gonna start having some uh, empathy there, or sympathy or whatever, however you say it. I thought she was gonna have emotion. But nah, like she just like, oh, like thinking about the lady being poor. It's what about um, payment plan or, or financing? There's gotta be something I could do to be able to pay. This is wait, 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 I work in housekeeping at a hotel in downtown. What if I volunteer to clean here for as long as it takes to pay off the surgery? Please, please, doctor, I will do whatever it takes for my baby. Unfortunately, Mrs. Cardona, that is not how it works. Okay, the hospital does need either a valid insurance plan or cash before we can operate. You can always take out a loan from your car or your home to get the cash. We rent, and my car is over 15 years old. I'd be lucky to get a few hundred for it. <laughs> Talk about sad. She doesn't even have a house and they're making us share a room with them. Yo, daughter, her daughter's sick and she over here talking to her daughter while her daughter sleep, talking about the lady to her daughter. Like, what kind of mother is that? Another option, would be to raise the money through family and friends. 
Most of my family and friends are in the same financial situation as me. I see. Well, it wouldn't hurt to ask. Maybe try GoFundMe? I wish there was more I could do for you, Miss Cardona. I'm sorry. She tried to go to the bank for a personal loan. Divide, oh man. She asked her family and friends to donate. She even started a GoFundMe page for her daughter, hoping to enlist help from the community. But none of it worked. No matter who she asked or where she looked. I ain't gonna lie, I feel like when people make up GoFundMe uh, little pages, they have to be promoting on their platforms that they made a GoFundMe. They can't just make one and then don't make any videos about it or talk about it online you have to try to make videos about it for people to even want to go and donate you know you can't just put a gofundme up but that's that's just how i know of the way that it works maria couldn't find a way to raise the money she needed for anna's surgery she was losing hope can't be possible. There has to be something you could do. Someone we can pay? We're doing everything we can to help your daughter. You're not doing it fast enough. My daughter is getting worse by the hour. It takes a long time to find a kidney donor, especially someone with an AB blood type like your daughter. Oh. But you're right. Oh. Your daughter is running out of time. And if we don't find a donor soon... What? She'll die? Are you going to tell me my little girl's going to die? I'm sorry, Mrs. Lanning. Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. Not that it's any of your business. You're right. It's none of my business. But I think I could help. Please. If all my money can't help save my- Did she think don't nobody- can nobody else help because they're poor? My little girl, there's nothing someone like you can do about it. I overheard you and the doctor speaking. So you're spying on me now? What? No. This is a small room. I heard the doctor mention that your little girl needs to find someone with AB blood for a kidney transplant. So? That is my blood type. And if it'll help save your little girl, I am more than willing to donate a kidney. <laughs> Seriously? After how nasty I was to you, you still want to help me? You don't want to be a child. I know that you're just a mother who's scared out of her mind because her little girl is in danger and you feel helpless and if i'm able to help another mother who's struggling through this nightmare and if it'll save your little girl in the process how could i not even if that mother has been look i hope this mother decides to help her and give her the money so she could pay for her daughter's operation. And a real pain in my butt. I, I... I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. I am not doing this for a thank you. I'm doing this because it is the right thing to do. Okay, look at her now. That's the most.
See you when you wake up, okay, baby? It's time, Mrs. Cardona. Then they get Anna ready for surgery. We're gonna be in OR three, okay? What, what's going on? Well, Dr. Adler and I, we're gonna be fixing your daughter's heart today. So by the time you wake up, Anna's gonna be feeling much better. I promise. But I, I never came up with the money. I, I can't afford it. That's all been taken care of, Maria. It's the least I can do for what you're doing for my daughter. Thank you. And for not just saving my daughter, but for reminding me that how you treat someone shouldn't be determined by how much money they have. I'm in awe of your kindness and courage. But I already told you that I'm not doing any of this to get something from you. No. You're doing it because it's the right thing to do. And so is this. When you get better, there's a job waiting for you at my company. It comes with an amazing- what? And she hooked her up with a job. You can't say this isn't a blessing, bro. Benefits package, so you'll never have to be put in this position again. I don't know how I'll ever thank you. You already have. Fish tanks, please. Yeah, Mom, can we? Sure, go ahead. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. Y'all, they're friends. You have an incredible daughter. So do you. <laughs> to new health and new friends. I loved it. I love this. Thank you for telling me to react to this. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos, and I'm out.